Every new year brings about a lot of change, some of which may have an impact on your wallet. Financial expert Justin Reppy from Goldstone Financial Group joins us now to share new money rules that we should be aware of this year. Good morning, Justin. Good morning. Thank you for having me. It's great to have you. Thank you very much. And uh, tax day is going to be here before we know it, of course. So what tax changes do we need to be aware of as we file this year? Well, there's been a significant number of tax changes that have uh, went into place just within the past couple of weeks with the passing of the SECURE Act 2.0. Um, one of those changes is in regards to the child tax credit. Uh, so for the 2022 filing season, the child tax credit and dependent care tax credits have both been reduced to $2,000 excuse me, per child and is capped at $6,000 for uh, those having multiple dependents. Okay, uh, yeah. So, yep. And, and when you think about the other tax changes we got to be aware of for 2023? Mm -hmm. uh, well, one significant one is in regards to IRA contribution limits. So the IRS has actually increased those limits by $500 for the 2023 tax year. So that being said, uh, those under the age of 50 can now contribute up to $6,500 into their either traditional or Roth IRA for this year. For those that are over the age of 50, uh, that increase is now up to $7,500 per year into that traditional IRA or Roth IRA. Okay, a little a chance to save a little more there. And uh, what other new rules should we be aware of in 2023? Uh, well, and uh, one thing to keep in mind as well is not only have the IRA limits changed, but so have the 401k limits. Uh, for those under the age of 50, that has now increased to 22500 per year. For those over the age of 50, that has now increased to a whopping $30,000 per year that you can sock away in your 401k plan to really supercharge that savings leading into retirement. I was just going to ask, so when you think about how this is going to impact people who are, are getting ready to retire or are saving for retirement, how will this impact them going forward? I mean, we have the opportunity to save even more. Mm -hmm. Well, you know, there's a, there's a lot of tax consequences uh, that come into play when you're talking about any kind of IRA or 401k plan. And one thing to be mindful of, too, is that the IRS also increases the federal income tax brackets on a yearly basis. And due to the inflation being as high as it was in 2022, those uh, tax brackets have actually increased a pretty substantial amount for 2023. So uh, if you're not aware of where you fall from a tax bracket perspective, uh, you can always go to irs.gov. Uh, to view the, the tax brackets so that way uh, you're just in the know about where you stand. Yeah, it is early in the year and we appreciate the heads up on all of those changes. Thank you so much, Justin. Appreciate it. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.